Raju, you're the first hotshot model we've had on the show. Uh, my and hot shirt model. Yes, you're a hot shirt model. Um, so how did modeling and all come to be? Were you always interested in fashion? A kind of. I was interested in, but uh, I was following my career. I'm a dentist. Okay. So I was doing it and I, one of my patients came in and he, in fact, asked me whether I'm interested in doing it. That's long back. Okay. That's in 2004, in fact. Right. Huh. So I said, yeah, of course, I'm interested. And okay. he, in fact, uh, he got me into a show. Hmm. After that, I never did anything. I went abroad for my studies. Hmm. Then, in between, I got uh, I got chances of doing it over there as well. Right. So I kind of done I've kind of uh, I've done better shows there. Mm -hmm. People never knew it over here. In fact, okay. whenever I used to come down to India, I I was doing it, but still it was you know sometimes one or two shows. That's it. Then I used to go back. Then I I left my thing. I was in UK. So I came down last November. Okay. So I started to take it uh, kind of seriously. seriously yeah. <clears throat> Thing is that then things start falling in place. Okay. I, I met designers. Mm. I met uh, choreographers. They kind of somehow by God's grace they like me, and I got a uh, chance to work in some of the major prestigious shows in the country. In fact, okay. like Black Me and Wills, and I worked with a few other great designers like. Uh, Rocky, yes, I've worked mm. with Manish, I've worked with uh, Nick Vijay Singh and then Rahani, okay. a few other names as well. So you worked with all these fabulous designers, so sometimes when they give you your wardrobe, like I work backstage on shows as well, when mm. they give you your wardrobe, sometimes you might not like it, so what, what is your reaction then? Do you just grin and bear it, do you just wear whatever they give The uh, thing is that a model is just like a hanger. Right, the designer is like expecting you to wear it, whatever they give you. Mm. That is, you have seen people walking on the ramp in FTV and all, right? Yeah, yeah. They don't have any emotions, they just walk straight and come back. Yeah. You know, they are being a hanger, that's it. Whatever they give you, you are supposed to wear it. Once mm. you are into, into the industry, you have to be professional. Okay. There is no second thoughts about that. I have seen models making okay, fuss about first, all these uh, things, yeah. But you don't believe but in I that. But I don't believe in that. Okay. Whatever I get, I wear it. So what would your personal fashion statement be? Like, what? Ideally, what do you see in it? No, I, I seriously feel uh, whatever makes me comfortable mm. is my fashion statement. Okay. Yeah. I like see. what you've got there. Exactly. Gotten on exactly. Like uh, very comfy sweatshirt. Uh, yeah, kind of. I love I your shoes. Where are they from? Thank you. I kind of travel abroad. Uh, whenever I see something, I buy it. Okay. Like that sort of. So, do you have any favorite brands? Do you, uh, any Nothing of that sort. Anything, anything which I can fit into, I buy that. <laughs> okay, <that's, laughs> that simplifies things a lot. Uh, kind of, yeah. Um, so, uh, do you at, wear designer labels at all? Because you work, worked with a lot of them. So, do you ever In feel fact, like you should wear yeah, I do, yeah, I do. I do. Not every Thing, but I do, okay. yes. Is it is it on a day-to-day -day basis or just for your, you know, any special nothing, occasion? Nothing, I don't so plan things. No day-to-day -day basis, nothing of that sort. Okay, so if you're going for a big short party or something of that sort, after party, mm. after the fashion week and all, mm. you have this after party stuff yeah. with all the celebrities, Bollywood coming in. Right. So that time you're supposed to win in a certain dress code, you know. Okay. Then they will, they are those kind of people, they will come and see you, what brand you are wearing and that okay. kind of stuff. So, right. being in their level, you are supposed to wear sometimes, <laughs> that sort of thing, that's it. So, are there any names that you particularly like or any favourite designs? I can't say that. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, all no. of them, being yeah. very diplomatic. Okay, that, so. <laughs> you can say that. Um, so, any, um, say for a guy who is out there, he wants to be a model, would you say, you know, would you have any tips for him, how do you, how do you get into modelling? Because you were lucky it happened by chance. Really. Exactly. Yeah. Well, I would say uh, you need to have a proper backup, either financially or personally. You need to have a safety net to fall back if it doesn't work out. Mm -hmm. That's the first time for most things. Right. And then you need to make godfather, so you need to have a godfather. Right. So that's the second thing. Okay. If you have both, then you can stop in it. Right. So, would you consider yourself a fashionable person or a stylish no, person? No, no, no. It is not me who will think that, you know. People <laughs> should say that. I don't okay. seriously see I am a fashionable guy. Okay. Would you be like, in, at any point in the future, would you like to be uh, known as a fashion icon or a style icon? Because, you know, people like John Abraham and all of them, you know, who have started out as a model and now they're like one of the biggest style icons around. So, would you ever fancy yourself like... To be that? very honest, I always fancy that. Wow, uh, okay. Not in the future, <laughs> right from <laughs> the beginning, yeah. Right. Okay. yeah. So, very honest. is that what prompted you to get into fashion at all? Yeah, everyone wants to be in the field of glamour, you know. Mm. Even if they don't want to be there, mm. they like uh, glamour and glitz and all those stuff. Okay, yeah. So, it was there in me, you know, it's there in you probably. <laughs> yeah, it's so, there in everyone. Yeah. 
So that's probably what got you. Exactly. Into this. Exactly. You jumped at the offer when the yeah, I was lucky enough. Yeah, uh, yeah. That, that was very right. lucky. So, um, is there any fashion icon that you look up to, like yeah, um, uh, someone you model yourself? There's after? a guy called Jason from Brazil. Jason what? Brazil. Okay. Oh, he's a hot shot guy. In uh, fact, he does international fashion week. Ah, he was kind of. No, oh, he was my friend before. Right. You know. Mm. So I always used to, you know. Whenever he comes on the TV and mm. people come around him, I always used to fancy that, in fact. Okay. And then in India, I have met Dino Moria, I have met Rajan Rampal and all. Mm. So, uh, you know, you get kind of inspiration when you see them, right? Yeah. yeah. What would your next step be? Like, uh, do you see yourself going on into the fashion field or do you ever see yourself going back to your dentistry? Uh, yeah, in fact, uh, the feel I'm in now, I am now uh, is not that you know. It's a short one, you know. Okay. The model's life is very short, mm. so I seriously feel uh, like going back to the industry after some time. Right. But at the moment, I want to jump into the movies. I got a few couple of good offers in my hand. Okay. I need to see. I need to see what's going to happen so, now. Uh, so we have to look forward to seeing you on the no, big screen. Till now, God has been you know. They're pouring it on me. I need. I seriously feel they're going to do it again. Okay. All right. That's good. Yeah. Um, so finally, to sum it all up, okay. um, what would your tips to our viewers be? You know, to stay stylish. Yeah. Uh, kind of. You know, you need to be glued to the TV first of all. Mm -hmm. you to need, keep abreast of all the Exactly. Trends, yeah. You need to see what the other people are wearing. Mm -hmm. You know, for example, what is happening in London Fashion Week will come to like May and Wales after, after that. Seasons, yeah. So if you update yourself to the International Fashion Week, mm -hmm. you get what's going to come back mm -hmm. to India. Yeah. So that is the better thing you can do. So you can always be like a fashion exactly. trend center. Yeah, yeah. Trend center exactly. To, exactly. Uh, okay, thank you so much for being on the show. It's been a pleasure. Yeah, it's my pleasure to come over here. In fact. Okay, Thanks thank a lot. You.